right, so uh, this morning, nice, uh, nice and early on a Sunday morning, I'm here about to fit my solar panels. Um, I've chosen a low profile look and uh, just to make sure that I stay clear of the bridges and everything else. Um, so I'm just going to have to set them out, measure them up, make sure that uh, nothing's going to um, come through. Let me show you around. So, as you can see, I've chosen these brackets. I've just put them up there for the time being. You can see the other ones are not uh, unwrapped properly yet. But I've gone for these low profile fittings. I'm not going to go tilting. Um, but I'm just going to make sure this is my living room and I believe my chimney for the log burner is going to come out about here but I'll measure up make sure that's going to be the case um, but I'm going to go two a side uh, sorry two wide and uh, three long so um, Let's uh, measure them up so they're perfect and uh, get them glued and screwed down so they can't be, uh, so the wind can't affect it. Um, I'll show you the stuff that I'm using and I'll also put some links in the description below if you uh, are interested in getting them yourself. But like I say, these are 375, yeah, these are 375 watt per panel and I've got six to fit and I've got all the cables and everything else and I'll talk you through the solar chargers and everything else. solar panels are going to lie. I've leveled them out, giving me enough warp space either side really. Um, 14 inches either side and then we've got quite a bit wider on the middle. Let's have a look, see what it looks like from that end. Yeah that looks quite square for me. I've gone for the middle to leave the back end uh, the stern quite clear 
so I've got plenty of uh, area I can stand on there for when I'm in locks and things and also I've kept the front completely clear just in case I wanted to sunbathe up here, I doubt I need to but 